In this video, we will discuss systems of linear equations and how to solve them using elimination and substitution. A linear equation in n variables, x sub 1, x sub 2, to x sub n, is an equation that can be written in the form a sub 1 times x sub 1 plus a sub 2 times x sub 2 plus all the things in between until we reach a sub n times x sub n is equal to b where the coefficients a sub 1 to a sub n and the constant term b are constants. Examples of linear equations are the following. First example, 3x minus 4y is equal to negative 1. Next example, r minus 1 half s minus 15 over 3 times t is equal to 9. And finally, we have x sub 1 plus 5x sub 2 is equal to 3 minus x sub 3 plus 2 times x sub 4. A system of linear equations is a finite set of linear equations, each with the same variables. Two examples of system of linear equations are given here. So this systems of linear equation has two equations with two variables, same with the other example. Now, let's try to solve systems of linear equation using elimination and substitution. Let's consider example 2.3. To solve the system, we need to eliminate one variable out of the system by adding or subtracting the equations or multiplying a constant term to the equations. In this case, adding the two equations will eliminate the y variable. Doing that, we have x minus y is equal to 1, x plus y is equal to 3 for the second equation. Adding the two equations gives us 2x is equal to 4. From here, we can now solve the value of x by dividing both sides by 2, giving us the value of x, which is equal to 2. Now, we have the value of x. We now solve the value of y. We choose any of the equations from the system and substitute the value of x to solve for the value of y. Let's use the second equation x plus y is equal to 3. Since we know that the value of x is equal to 2, we substitute x with 2 and perform the given operation. We get the value of y, which is equal to 1. Therefore, the solution of the system of linear equation is 2, 1. Another example is example 2.4. In this case, adding nor subtracting the two equations will not eliminate a variable. However, we can multiply 3 on the first equation to make the coefficients of the y variable equal but different sign. So let's do that one. We multiply the first equation by 3, and this gives us 6x minus 3y is equal to 3. Copying the second equation, we have x plus 3y is equal to 5. Adding the two equations, we get 7x is equal to 8. From here, we get the value of x by dividing both sides by 7, which is equal to 8 over 7. Using any of the equation, we solve for the value of y. Using the first equation, we substitute the value of x, which is equal to 8 over 7. Performing the operation, we multiply 2 and 8 over 7. That is 16 over 7. 
minus y is equal to 1 by additive property of equality, we change the sign of negative y and transfer it on the other side of the equation. Same with positive 1. And this gives us the following equation. Performing the operation, this gives us 9 over 7 as the value of y. Therefore, the solution is 8 over 7, comma 9 over 7. That's it for our video. Thank you very much for watching and have a good day.